Hey guys, welcome back to uh, Crypto Kingdom 78. If you haven't seen one of my uh, swap videos for SafeMoon before, just uh, buying more SafeMoon. Uh, I'm going to show again with zero slippage. Uh, still continue uh, to see people buy with slippage on SafeMoon. I have no idea why they're losing tokens. I mean, you can apply my strategies and techniques on any token, ERC20, BEP20. I have PSafeMoon as well. Now, I'm still hooked up to Trust Wallet on three different accounts, actually, I have now because I do have SafeMoon over at SafeMoon Wallet, but I jumped on a SafeMoon Wallet the first day to kind of pump the price up and started buying tokens, not thinking, oh, wait a minute, I should put my 12-digit phrase in or pass phrase from Trust Wallet to link them right off the bat. I actually, I was so excited finally when the Android came out and the iOS you know, eventually after, I didn't even pay attention to the, um, you know, <laughs> the uh, part where you can take your 12-digit phrase and put it in right off the bat. I didn't even think that was ready yet. I just, I was too excited. But that's okay. I mean, I'm going to wait. They're coming up with a fix for that. So you'll be able to enter your 12-digit phrase without wiping. I don't want to do the clear and wipe on the SafeMoon wallet. And I don't want, also want to send them back and forth and lose 10, 20 million tokens both directions. Uh, 10 million back to trust and then wipe and then start fresh and then send everything over. I don't want to do that with the 12 digit uh, password. I'd rather just wait until they come up with a fix because at, at this point right now, other than using the swap, it's not really before version two. It's not really helping us. Like we're not gaining anymore as far as this point stands today in November 11th. We're not uh, gaining any more SafeMoon by having it on SafeMoon Wallet at this point. As SafeMoon Wallet progresses, well, I think there's going to be incentives of holding it over there. So again, I'm just going to do a small swap. It's probably not going to be much. It's not going to be one of my like $5,000 buys or anything like that. It's just for anybody that's new to the channel that's missed, again, more how to buy videos. I'm using SafeMoon because I don't mind keeping to add to my SafeMoon. I'm sitting at around $39 billion and change. Because I'm not, I forgot to add up what I have on the SafeMoon wallet. I have over 100, uh, I think 200 million regular. And then I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with the P SafeMoon. I did buy the Ethereum based uh, SafeMoon. I thought by owning the Ethereum based SafeMoon, if a project came along and SafeMoon goes up like another 1000x like it should, and then when it goes to the new version 2, I thought it might be handy to have some P SafeMoon in case one of our new ERC 20s comes along and I need Ethereum quick. So I thought, okay, then I could just swap it back for Ethereum and make a buy if I'm in a hurry rather than having it all be P20 because um, I just can't, um, you know, I just can't spend the time to do it and I can't just base my tokens, um, you know, buying on BEP20s because there's been dynamite ERC20s. I mean, I could just, I can name five right off the top of my head. There were 1101 to 1105 that are all in the 10 zero, mid 10 zero to uh, high 10 zero range now and you can't not buy them because of a hundred dollar fee that's why if you think about using my strategy and technique or whatever you want to call this on the zero slippage really those gas fees everybody keeps not mentioning this in the comments which i don't know why i'm saving you like fifty dollars thirty fifty dollars worth of tokens on erc20 by using this buy technique everybody else is telling you put like 14 slippage in 12 on safe moon you don't need any slippage on SafeMoon. I don't know why people keep paying slippage and use the tokens. It doesn't matter how many you're buying. But my point is, what do you think the gas fee really is if you're buying, you know, let's say one B and B and up, let's say, for example, on ERC20. Right now, if we buy P SafeMoon, for example, I'm not going to buy P SafeMoon. I'll probably buy regular here on the, on the example here because I'm logged into trust with the Binance account. But anyway, what do you think you're saving on the gas fees if they're 120, 140 bucks and I just saved you... I don't know how many billions of tokens, but it could be $50, $60 worth of tokens. You got to take that in consideration. It's all the overall value of what you get after the transaction. It's not just so much, oh, I bought 17 billion tokens and I got nailed with a $200 gas fee. Yeah, but if you had to pay the slippage and you didn't know how because you didn't watch my videos before, you would have only got like 13 billion or something like that. You, everybody see what I'm saying? Like... You have to take into consideration. I'm saving you by watching, by making these videos on the token uh, number of quantity that you're getting. So let's go over to swap. So again, I'm connected through TrustWall. You can connect to this any any way you want. Okay. So I got like over. I have my BNB ready. I'm going to stack this up to probably like three. I had one specifically 
um, on here because of the pre-sale of Panda Girl tomorrow was kind of what I was uh, aiming for. I'm not quite done wheeling and dealing to get, I was trying to get three BNB because I wasn't quite sure where that one was going to go. This isn't really a safe moon video, except it's one of my favorite ones. And I'm just using it for an example because I continually see people buying safe moon with high slippage for some reason. I don't know why, because it's not very hard to do. Anyways, click those little, uh, I don't know what you call these things next to that uh, exclamation thing with the circle here to the right of pool. I don't know what you call them, like electrical connectors i don't know what the, those things actually are slippage tolerance 0 0.1 which is zero now i'll just put in whatever like i'll just pick safe moon so i got eight and a half billion in this one hit i understand so this is the one that brings me to like 38 and a half 39 and then i got some over in, so that's how i get to my 39 billion of safe moon um let's just put in like i don't know it doesn't really matter to me something round 10 million safe moon so three Three, so that should be um, 100,000 million, 10 million safe moon, okay? So it's not much, it's like whatever. Bottom line is, you put the price on there, get rid of that thing, put decimal zero right here. Hit swap. Now if it's gonna work, okay, um, it's not even gonna go to the next page. There it is, $46.39, done. It's going to approve this. Here again is buying a token, SafeMoon, one of the most popular ones online, almost 3 million holders, 0% slippage. No problem. I could have bought, you know, 100 grand worth, 500 grand worth, no problem. There it is. So we'll go to the smart call contract executed, go to more details. That's how I like to do it on TrustWall. I like to pull it off off the top. Okay, so I had to pay the tax 10%. So there it is. 9 million safe moon. All I did was pay the 10% tax. Didn't cost me 0.1% slippage. It cost me zero slippage. So again, not financial advice, just another video, just to, you know, to just um, kind of uh, reduce the number of, I'm getting about 500 messages a day, which is okay, I, I don't mind, but they're just repeated messages. So the more how-to videos I put up, the better. This is how to use safe moon swap. Zero slippage.